attacking the goal to our right. Juventus, of course, in their familiar black and white stripes. As he was certainly in the first meeting between the two sides back in December. He had an inspired afternoon at the Berg, and Juventus, although missing some of their regulars, were really outplayed that afternoon. Fiorentina winning by two goals to nil. This is Laura. Former Juventus player, so he'll be keen to impress today. Poyant says the referee, away goes Laura, giving Fiorentina the advantage. To the Italian squad for the World Cup game against Switzerland next weekend. Carobi, Laura. Ruzzi, who's been recalled in goal today having been out through injury. He's got a bit of a thankless old task this afternoon, playing up there on his own against the likes of Curler and Julio Cesar. Yes, Arrigo Saki uh, certainly favours him. He seems to pick Casaragi for the national team when he's fit. In lockdowns. Di Mauro to Laudra. Two goals in his last three games by Laudra. Carobi. Laudra. And in midfield. Show too much of that to Karobi. Bayano. Laudra. That's tremendous pace, Laudra. Rocky with the cross. Not by Pioli. Laudra, the lovely layoff at Pioli. Laudrup. Support arriving with Carlo Charlie, who was caught then by Marocchi. Effenberg releasing Laudrup. Now, was that a push by Marocchi? That's the third occasion that Juventus have found themselves in the penalty area. Unfortunately, they haven't been awarded the, the penalty. That... Laudrup. Patient pulled up by Fiorentino, but then they have the acceleration of Laudrup. Laudrup in support too, and Bayano away to his left. Here's Laudrup. Down to Charlie now. Lead forward. Here's Laudrup now with him with the corner. Effenberg, good save by Peruzzi. Still got several up in this attack, Fiorentina. And then here is Laudrup. Now Carly Charlie, who's onside. Another dangerous ball in. And the shot just squirming wide. Laudra. Carlo Charlie streaking through. It's near side again. Lazio currently in third place above Juventus. Laudra. Here's Di Mauro. By Laudra, away from Carrera, lightning burst of speed again. Effenberg, good strike. But he's threatened to enter that tally on at least two occasions in this game so far. Almost into time added on for stoppages. Laudra trying to commit defenders. Broken up though, De Mauro to Laudra, needing support. Arrives in the shape of Effenberg, who nearly got away from Dino Baggio there. To European final with your club in your first season there is a, a tremendous achievement. Played really well too. And the reflection might have gone anywhere then off Pioli, but he took the sting off the shot. Didn't quite call that for Viali. And here's the danger again of the counter-attack. As Lambert goes speeding away, now on for Viano, who's just offside. to play the ball down the, down the line as a defender. Effenberg. In for Laudrup. I'll be change of direction then by the Danish international. Support two from Laudrup. And inevitably Karna Charlie out wide here. Covering though by Dino Baggio. Laudrup. No chance to use his searing pace, and it's a Charlie. 
surging runs from him down the flank. From Bird, because he did tend to run the show and slow the game down for uh, Fiorentina in the first half. Laudra. To Effort Burr, all too tight though. Vanelli beavering away. Not smart hit by Laudra. Now Karobi. To enable Julio Cesar to get his tackle in. Laudra with the corner. Out by Conte. A corner really from his stand. As there we see that lovely little pass. And, uh, by the season. And the second inspired substitution by, by Baggio. Now drop for the header, hoping to combine with Bayano. They're leading by three goals to nil at home to Ancona. And they're in London on Tuesday. Inter playing in a triangular tournament against Tottenham and also Real Madrid.